it's me, Zell, and we are here with another reaction video of Andor. It'll be episode 8 today, Narkina 5, whatever that is. But yeah, it's um, going to be interesting because we ended last episode with um, Cassia Andor getting um, put in jail for, what was it, 6 years? Something ridiculous for literally not doing anything but getting mistaken for potentially running away for maybe stealing something i don't know anyways it got all mixed up you know corruption messed up legal system going on there but there you have it you know we left off uh supervisor miro just got it kind of got kind of got promoted or she got the planet she wanted so now she kind of has permission to continue to do what she's been doing and investigate and find out all these things are tying together right and then we have cyril cyril i always get his name mixed up the guy that used to be a um, corporation po private police and now he's working in a desk job and he's just melting away all of his sanity. But somehow he's going to get drawn in because he is drawn in. If he sees Cassie and he recognizes him, he's like, I have a I have a vengeance, something to pick with him. Anyways, I'm terrible with. So we have they're going to connect. Con they're all coming together, wanting to come after this one particular person, which sucks for you, Cassian. Sorry about that, bud. Wonder what's going to happen when you're in the system. You're going to be in jail somewhere working, you know, about right back where you came from, which is not fun. Um, Mon Mothma has to deal with some of this uh, potentially backlash, but uh, with the stealing the heist. But she also just kind of got a secret partnership with funding, mysterious funding through a banking system. So that'll be interesting. Curious to see that. But yeah, anyways, let's just get going and see what we're in store for this next episode of Andor. So let's get to it. He's like, holy crap. Oh, they're getting 10 sent away somewhere. They got that many prisoners from a tourist planet okay what uh oh oh maybe supervisor miro wants him shoes off but they're little toesies he's nervous he's like what did i do i'm just I'm Lieutenant Ed Ramiro. I'm the ISB supervisor for the Morlana sector. What happened to Lieutenant Bluffin? I lost the questions. Ferrix, I've been so reviewing the incident. Your standards for less than a month, and you filed five false inquiries. Six, actually. Cassian Andor is a murderer and a threat to the Empire. I have been trying, with the limited tools available, to find him. So this is about public safety? And revenge. Is there anything you'd care to tell me before I waste more of my time figuring out what it is you are up to? I'm just trying to clear my name. One would think you'd want to leave Ferex as far behind as possible. One would be wrong. Ooh, the visualization on that. Narkina 5 looks like a moon, maybe? They had to travel in this rickety thing? Oh my goodness. Oh, wait. Why do those look familiar? These are just prison? Someone there is talking. We need to be listening. It's a large investment. It's a fraction of the price of lost technology. Oh. It's the first best lead we've had. Supervisor Mero has convinced me that this Axis has been nimble in spreading his activities across the galaxy. The little we are aware of is already troubling. Drill down, find Andor, and get a hunt started. Ooh, she's ruthless, man. Very tactical. She's doing this role great. Their poor little feet. So interesting. Maybe the last fresh air we ever taste. Do they have to wear those boats? Because if they tried to jump, Welcome to Narkina they'd sink. Five. Oh my gosh. The floors are electrifying them. Our floors and everyone gets. Do your time productively. Keep to your lane, and this needn't be more than a memory. 
terrifying, Stop! but brilliant. Line up! Single file! Here's what we'll do, Mr. Khan. You'll stop filing requests for Andor. Anticipating that, I will inform the Bureau of Standards that you were of service to the Empire today. He's like, what? I was what? a deputy inspector. I solved a double murder and found the killer in two days. It was overly ambitious, yes, but time was slipping away and the opportunity was real. Sounds familiar? Service to the Empire. You just said it. I wish you luck. I'm running late. It's clear you need Andor in order to find his partner. It's also clear that whatever this is, is more important than the death of two corporate security guards. Raise the alarm one more time, and it won't be me you're speaking to. Forget this happened. Oh, snap. He wants a job, yo. Unfortunately, it was a bad day. On program. Step onto the lift and stop. Set step off now. Move. Man, so bossy. This is unit 52D. Hey! Level five, room two. The D is for day shift. Please. Seven levels of factory, seven rooms per level. My name is Kino Loy. I'm the 52D unit manager. I no. love Andy Circus. Kiv. Off program! Back to work! Sick, injured, you talk to me. Problems with another inmate? I will know before you do. Losing hope, your mind, keep it yourself. I Don't love him ever so much. Slow up my line. Table five. That makes me excited. I did not expect him. Jimbo, welcome. Go. Karga. Ula. Ham. Ham. This is Melvin. Right? There's so much yeah. happening so quickly. Work. We're calling a new plot. Okay, listen up. Oh this my gosh. This will be a sprint segment. All right, help him out. Away. Yeah. Come on, I'm boy. stressed. Let's go. Let's go. That's so much pressure, man. I don't even know where he would fit into this. They're rushing. My heart is increasing. Oh my gosh. You think they're gonna suspect an affair? They're like, yes, that's exactly what's happening. Oh, he's communicating. I love that they show you that their feet like a constant reminder that the fear they're living. Water, night light, toilet flips down, You've got a plate, spoon, and shaver. And food? The tube. You can get as much as you want. They like us healthy and fueled. Don't worry, you learn to eat it. When it gets taste with their food. So Top he got fried flavor. again. Last place gets fried. Uh, oh, they have flavorless day. food? And that is your tab. The public order decree. The resentencings. I'm oh, sorry. All the rebel activity. It's rebel nonsense. I don't know anything about it. They slaughtered a garrison and burned it down. Does it matter? We're the ones get punished. Hey. You're until they don't want you anymore. Enough! Get straight with that. Mouth Street! Things are getting it now. It's dreaming. Those days are over. The oh. I said that's enough. He doesn't want to. Return to your cells immediately. Hot floor! Where's the manager's room? I wonder if sometimes they choose to die, you know, because they've had enough. No, Mon became a senator at 16. So this oh. is where we met. No, we'd already been married a year. So Whoa. Romantic. And traditional. Ah, the sizzling of the floor in the evening to remind you of the coming pain and suffering you have to endure. Mmm. Gosh, that makes, sounds so disgusting. Do they get to do like exercise or something? Oh, this is their shower. A group showering. Or steaming. A steam. That could be nice, like a sauna. 
They get nice clean clothes. I guess they get exercise when they lift those and moving around. Well, maybe they can help other teams, right? If they get ahead. Hey! You just taking a breather. Come on, guys! You got a chance of winning the ship today. Shame to waste it. Keep, keep. Bossy. Oh, there's his buddy. Something ruggedly handsome about him. What have you done now? Oh, I'm flying a party. Oh, the boys had to carry you back here. Ooh, it travels fast. She wanted to see if the tunnel under the hotel was still open. Why? So the rebellion can sneak in and take them by surprise. Oh. She's a rebel. Oh, Who's the big one? I have no idea. Oh, that they, at least they're together the again. Is about to come looking. You love me because I show you what you need to see. Don't you hurt him or her. Pack. The woman's name is Bix Kaleen. Vel could have a look if it's safe. They know what they're doing. I just need you to wake up. There's a lot to do. Shut it down. No more connection. Don't do it. Oh no. Yep, I knew it. And no one can help him. Who is it now? He railed it, jumped. Oh, yeah, well, we'll be smelling him all night. Here? He rails it here. He was slipping, you could see it. I don't care, man. He railed here at night. I've got no shut up about it. The other one's going to be short handed all day. Sad. Where are they taking my father? Tell oh, me. no. Where is he? Where is my father? Give up. Silence. Oh no, she got them in trouble. Oh no. Colleen! Bix Colleen. Get this whole beast, run! Get her! Oh, that was an interesting transition. Cool. <gasps> oh! Son at old Donnie. Is that <gasps> you? I was just about to ask you the same thing. You'd never it's... tell me if it was. Aren't you tired of playing behind the scenes, Luther? Aren't you tired of fighting with people who agree with you? You come all this way to scold me? Or did you bring me some toys? Hmm. Anto Krieger. I want you to meet him. <laughs> Anto Krieger? He's been probing the Imperial Power Station at Spellhouse. The man is an ox. Slow. And stupid. That's strong. <laughs> I want you to hear his plan. We need the Empire to help. We need them angry. We need them coming down hard. Oppression breeds rebellion. Neither of you could do it on your own, but together. Krieger's a separatist. My pays a neo Republican. The Gorman Front. The Partisan Alliance. Sectorist. Human cultist. Galaxy partitionist. They're lost. All of them, lost! Lost! And you're not, Saw? I'm a man who's terrified the Empire's power will grow beyond the point where we can do anything to stop it. I'm the one who says we'll die with nothing if we don't put aside our petty differences. Petty? <laughs> I am the only one with clarity. A bit of a luxury, I'd argue, to a man who's hiding in cold caves. I'm begging for spare parts. Ooh. No yeah. sale today, Luffy. Yeah, Saw's always been stubborn in his ways. Right. Come on. Number one. Just rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat that daily regimen. Wow, this was a, another good, strong episode. Um, 
It felt a lot more fast paced, I think, because of that starter, the tension build up with that new prison they're in. Very unique and interesting um, and terrifying. Hey, let's all be barefoot and uh, all of you will suffer if you act out. So have fun with that. Um, and then the whole like racing with the clock with your job, 12 hour shifts, and then going back to eat some unflavored, nasty tube food. Ugh. Wow. Do we expect that Cassian will be in this jail for the full duration or do we think some sort of a uh, bust out was going to happen? It's pretty, it's a pretty hefty prison. So I don't know what it's looking like, but um, yeah, it was fun to see Saw, Saw and Luthen come together. And again, still very, uh, very anarchist, stubborn in his way, not wanting to play friendly with others, not happy with the direction they are going even though other people are rebelling in their own ways he wants to do it his way only so that's that and now the people friends of cassie and on ferrix are suffering because the their connection to unknowing to them connecting to this rebellion interest of the isb individual who named luthan obviously we know and now they're getting individuals are getting tortured Cassian's mom is sick. I'm sad to see all these things happening. Cassian has no idea. Like, no one realized he's actually in prison, but curious to see what happened to Cyril. Cyril. I have a hard time saying that. Disappointing. It could have easily, like, I mean, I'm sure it takes way more to become part of the ISB, become an Imperial agent. You have to go through the Academy or whatnot, but he had certainly a direction he was interested in going, but he wants to become some sort of asset work and get the revenge he so desperately wants you know mon mothma is having some issue with her finances and the connection to the banks and um all that jazz so a lot of plays are in, are going on in these stories the dynamics a lot coming together not to mention obviously cinta and bell are trying to also come after him <laughs> But he's tucked away safe, but be, you know, safe in his prison. But because all these interested parties, that's probably what eventually going to lead to him somehow to being removed from the facility and trying to have information drawn from him. So we only have one episode left, right? Or was this the end? I don't know. I have so many questions now, but definitely leaves in a cliff cliffhanger. Nonetheless, so many questions. So um, maybe this is the last episode. Maybe we have another but I've been really liking the show. It's a lot of buildup. It's just so well acted and the scenes are set up. I feel like I'm watching, you know, when you're watching like a really good drama show, I want to say like a typical show, like, like a detective show or um, a really good drama. Again, because the writing is so well done and the acting is so well done. The story is interesting and, and built in that moments of tension. It feels different than the typical Star Wars, which typically has a little bit more almost like fanfare and like pizzazz and like, you know, no lightsabers or even a lot of like um, gun action is going on. It's very much all about like this undertones and um, everyday difficulty. I don't know how to do it. Just very earthly down the down the planet or if you will. So and this episode interestingly felt, I mean, almost horror esque at the beginning, like especially going to the prison and the fear that you were having, like that vibe that main prison guy initially was giving was like, you don't want to mess with us. Notice we don't have any weapons. Well, look down below you and then let's give you a taste of what you could expect. And that that's a daily punishment, just completely mortifying, like really, really terrifying concept to be trapped there. So I was feeling, I was feeling that for them, for what they're having to deal with, but Whew. Things are definitely ramping up. Um, just again, Andor has been really well, well done. Like a really good show. It's something that, yeah, you can appreciate for just overall being a well written story. Um, not to say that Star Wars isn't normally well written or well acted or anything, but it seems like it feels less fantasy in sci-fi in a way like it's almost like it's a backdrop in like a theme but it's not but the main story is on the interpersonal struggles the government struggles like the system all that it's it's just brilliantly done so i appreciate it um so i'm excited to see the next season or next episode, what have you, and um, the direction they're gonna take with that. We obviously are getting like this 
beginnings backdrop of Andor before he's even really cares about the rebellion. He doesn't really have a care for it yet. He's just trying to do more self-centered surviving, which rightfully so, like no one asked to join that. But yeah, anyways, guys, thanks for being here and watching. If you enjoyed this reaction review, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Andor may be done or almost done, um, but there's plenty more Star Wars to come and other content I am going to be um, reacting to, such as Tales of the Jedi, which is also out currently. And we have, of course, the future with Boba and Mandalorian, Ahsoka, plenty there. So if you enjoy any in any way my reactions and reviews, commentary, what have you, feel free to subscribe. That's the best way to be alerted and support the channel. So appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys being here and I will see you on the next one.